Hi guys, welcome back to our channel here at Life Done Simple. Today's video is to take you along as we rebuild our chicken coop and run. It was a really fun uh, and difficult project, but definitely very worthwhile. To say we love the new space is an understatement, and I can certainly say that our chickens are very happy. The build itself was very simple, we didn't do anything over the top. Um, we don't take you along with specifics, it's just more of a follow along, but we hope you enjoy. This weekend project is sorting out the outside of our tiny house. So at the moment, underneath the tiny, we have got some items that have been in storage under there since we've moved in. So these are large items that we don't access very often, so Christmas decorations and such. Um, and we've also got our chickens out this side here. So we currently have that set up with some lattice work. So that's a temporary fix. It's worked really well, but it's just not so um, pretty. So we're wanting to redo that to give them uh, a setup similar to that of the ducks, which I will show you now. All this over here is some more building material we got gifted. And you can see a bit under the trailer where we've got some items stored. That will all be sorted out today, hopefully. And then our duck pen, which is what the rest of the chicken coop should look like when we're done. So it is a bit of a late start for us this morning and it's time to feed the animals and the chickens. They are a little bit cranky with us because it is later and there is some carnage happening as we work on trying to increase their chicken run, which, oh, that sounds in a bit of a poor spot, which you can see just behind me. So we have actually um, denied their access to this portion just so we can finish that up today. So they're in a very small space at the moment. They are not happy, so yes, we will feed them. I'll take you along for that. Um, feed the ducks as well, and um, then I'll take you along with us while we do the rest of our day. So we've got to do some work in the shed today, and we're also going to finish that chicken run. We will eventually also be redoing our chicken coop, so I'll just flip you around so you can see that. So that is currently our chicken coop. We made this using scrap pallet wood. Uh, when we first moved into our tiny house um, and we've got some old roofing material on the top there from my um, parents deck and we also used PVC pipe which was a brilliant idea um, and a cheap option for us when we first moved uh, we have moved this little chicken house around a few times though and it has taken it a little bit of a beating We'll be hopefully building a new one out of the same material as the run there. So let's feed these chickens. We've just got some chicken feed here. So I soak this overnight for them. Chook, 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 chook. Chook, 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 chook. There you go, chickies. Unfortunately, we lost all the footage of us building the actual coop. So here you can see the coop in its finished state. This took us a full day to complete. So we did the frame and then we reused the wire mesh from our old coop and the old laying box as well. The roof is just made with some leftover colorbond sheeting from my parents' renovation from their fencing. <music> I'm just painting the 
the PVC feeder and water art that we have already in our existing coop. So just making it black so it matches the aesthetics of the coop itself. <laughs> to find a design I liked for our chicken coop sign so I came up with this design and printed it using Vistaprint. If you would like a copy of the image so you can print one yourself I will link that below. We are loving our chicken coop and are so impressed with what we were able to achieve using recycled materials. It's clean, it's chic, it is weatherproof and the chickens seem to love it as much as us. We hope you enjoyed building a chicken coop with us and if you haven't already please subscribe and we'll catch you in our next video.